Like a lot of people, I've been captivated by the story of Martha Ballard that has been popularized in the recent book, The Frozen River, and clearly a badass midwife and just really an interesting story. But I think the unsung hero in all of this has to be the historian Laurel Thatcher Ulrich. Now, it's important to understand that Martha Ballard left this diary that had a lot of annotations, but it, it wasn't really a diary. She wasn't writing it like correspondence to somebody. She was writing this for herself and making lots of annotations in it that she understood. And it was, uh, Laurel Thatcher Ulrich says, it's really more like a day book. And so as a historian, uh, or a lot of historians reject it because it seems boring. But Laurel Thatcher Ulrich doesn't just recognize the importance of it. She brings it to life by going and doing the really hard work of, you know, taking each entry apart, correlating, categorizing things. And uh, if you want to see, get a sense of what she did, you can watch the PBS uh, documentary. It was, I think, an American tale. Um, and it's called The Midwife's Tale, and you can get it on Amazon and watch it there. And it, and it has Laurel Thatcher Ulrich in it, and you see her with a binder, right? Because this is, she does this research in the 80s. She publishes in the early 90s. She worked on it for eight years. She's doing this without a computer, folks. This is pencils, loose leaf binders, right? And she is, for each entry, you know, categorizing what it says and, and collating these things. But more than that, she is going out and doing the hard work of looking up other people's diaries, the histories of the time, what was going on that day. And so she's able to put together kind of like a code breaker, right? She gives us the context to understand what these comments, these, you know, like sometimes it's a double X, right? Sometimes a number. Other times it's very short. Somebody dropped by to visit. And but she's like, well, look, this was during an epidemic or this was what was going on. So Laurel Thatcher Ulrich really is the Rosetta Stone to the Martha Ballard story. And we have to recognize that this is a badass historian. Now, you might have heard of her, by the way. She, Laurel Thatcher Ulrich, is the historian who coined, coined the phrase, well-behaved women seldom make history. Okay, that's her, right? So she's already cool with that. But she really brings this to life. And so while I really love Ariel Lahone's book, and I think she's done a great job of bringing Mar Martha Ballard to life and personalizing her, really the, the idea, the window, and, you know, the first, you know, giving her a name, right? There was a lot of research into Martha. You know, Martha Ballard doesn't write her name on this. This is her own diary, right? It's so good to me. Um, they're just things that, that we wouldn't know without Laurel Thatcher Ulrich. So, you know, tip of the hat to the second truly badass woman in this story. And I mean, Ariel Lahone, she's, she's pretty good too. But I, I've just got to say, in terms of groundbreaking and doing stuff that, um, you know, in the 80s, bringing the history of women to light, you know, this is another pioneering thing. So big tip of the hat to Laurel Thatcher Ulrich.